welcome to this how to play awesome cutlery song video. If you haven't already, do check out the link below to the introduction to all of these videos so you can understand what I'm talking about in the specifics that come up now. This song is It's a Light and a Hammer. This one's a, a fun one to play, pretty easy. Uh, on the sheet music you have a right hand written for the intro firstly, here's how I play it. So a bit slower. So I'm always sounding these two notes along with whatever's on the little finger. Then I change to the C chord, but I do C and the D in the right hand there. That's lower. Those two together. Then just do the whole thing twice. suspended chord on the D uh, over hand uh, in your hand in your hand you can play with that as you want then this next bit the king has given on the piano I do this but Bah, rhythm. The king has given words to us to tell us what he's like. This is the voicing there about how I play this chord. So E minor in the third inversion, and then I move to the D sharp and move that E down in the right hand as well. Then down to a, a G in the second inversion over D in the bass in the left hand. Seven. I don't usually play the E there. And so that's the pulsing. I, actually, I do put in another note there sometimes as well. And then in the open up your ears, just straight uh, beats. Two bars. Open up your ears and let it spin. Then back into that pattern at the beginning. You just go into that uh, intro riff again. To make us well. And you can finish the song there, playing that link out to, to end it. Uh, one note: this is a very easy song to go too quick. So the thing to check is the chorus pace. It's a light and a hammer, it's a fire and a sword, it's the voice of a father, the word of the Lord. What I found uh, is it's very easy to go too quickly in the build-up. Open up your eyes and let it spin, great strike. And then you've got poor people trying to do, it's a light and a hammer, it's a fire and a sword. And if they're trying to do actions as well, then you're going to give someone a hernia. So best to just keep it uh, back, held back a little bit. Definitely don't try and replicate the album because that's... Um, that's way too quick to do uh, with a congregation, I think. So don't um, don't try that. For it's a light and a hammer. Uh, I do um, some chord shapes the same each time. So with the G as normal, with then D, I I always um, try and play the F sharp in the bass. Hold the power of the universe. But if you don't do that, if you don't play that note, it's fine. Just do it as normal. Play C like this, with 
these two fingers here. So going for that, hold the pad. Oh, oh, sorry. Let's start with the introduction first. first half, uh, first part of the uh, verse, um, you may have noticed uh, I've gone a bit quick at the beginning of that, thinking about it's a light and a hammer, that's the place to set the speed. It's a light and a hammer, it's a fire and a sword. So the verse should be, hold the power of the universe in your hand. Uh, there, I'm trying to follow my own advice, not going too quick. Uh, for the uh, pre-chorus bit, the king has given Guitar, uh, guitar chords a little trickier, but I'll do E minor. The king has given like this. The king has given, and then I'll go to B seven, which I'm doing um, every other string on the second fret, and then my uh, index finger on the third string on the D string, just here. So it sounds like this. So move from E, e minor to that. That's quite tricky. Especially as it's going quickly. King has given words to us. If you can't, yeah, if you can't do all of that, then just move this one down. The king has given words to us. That's the note to play to pick out. The king has given words to us. Then G over D to tell us what he's tell us what he's like. A A chord of that like. And then go into the A7. Oh, so go through that um, all, all the way through, um, going a bit slower. The king has given words to us to tell us. <laughs> the king has given words to us to tell us what he's like. Open up your ears and let this be. You can hear that jogging. G over B like this. And I rest my thumb there to make that not ring out so much. so on. 